My friends call me Murphy. You call me Robocop. What's going on all you beautiful builders out there? Welcome back to the channel. Today we've got box 5, stages 15 through 18 of the Fan Home Build Your Own Robocop. If you guys are interested in building this as well, I'll leave a link in the description down below. But without wasting any more time, let's go ahead and get up top and get this thing open. Alright guys, here we go. We got our box. Let's go ahead and crack this open. Fan Home, Diagostini, whatever you want to call them. Let's see what we got inside. All right, we got pieces here, 15 through 18. Okay, and here's our magazines, all four of them. And it looks like they sent another uh, magazine holder. So we'll put that to good use. Go ahead and sit that to the side. All right, looks like our box is empty, so let's go ahead and get rid of that. Right, here's all four of our magazines guys let's go ahead and get started on stage 15. come quietly or there will be trouble all right here's stage 15 let's go ahead and get a look inside there we go bruise through real quick the role of the media here all right we're going to get into finishing up that left foot that we were working on here putting the uh base of the foot and the toe pad and everything on we'll get done we'll have the other completed foot military robots here atmospheric energy got all kinds of stuff in it let's go ahead and get started all right we got our foot from our last issue here we're gonna get our fantic screwdriver out yeah, we're going to start by putting our bottom of our foot on here. It's just going to sit in like that, and we're going to go ahead and screw that in with five CM screws. Yeah, before we do that, though, I'm going to put a little oil on all the little holes inside. Just a little bloop on all five of them. And it just helps the screws go in a little easier. Put that back on. And here we go. There we go. And that's all five screws in there. It's going to look just like that. Okay, now we're going to put the toe cap on, and that's going to go on just kind of the same way. We're going to put it on just like this. Screw it in with two more of those CM screws. But, again, I'm going to put a little oil to help those screws go in a little easier. Yep. Put that toe cap on there. And screw it in. All right, let's come in on a side shot and see if we can get a little better look at it here. There's two. There we go. It's gonna look just like that. And that is the other foot. All right, that's the end of stage 15. Let's go ahead and move on to stage 16. That are alive, you are coming with me. All right, here we go, stage 16. Get a look in the magazine here. The filming sets, factory sequence, Okay, we're going to get into our build here. Looks like we're going to be starting on the left lower leg. And uh, this is going to be our parts here. And some of it's going to be attaching to this foot. All right, when we get done, it's going to look like this. It's going to be this section here on the left foot. Talking about real everyday robots here. All right, let's go ahead and get started. All right, let's get our foot back over here. And we got part 16C and 16D. That's this piece here in this spring. And those are going to be going over this pin right here on the foot, as you can see here. And it's going to go this way around. You got the, uh, the grooves on this piece here, which is a metal piece. And it's going to go into the grooves on here. So we're just going to set it in just like that. And then the spring is going to go on the top of that. There we go, just like that. And now we got 16B, which is this piece here, also a metal piece. And it's going to go over both of those and close that in. And as you can see, it's got a little notch in it right here, which is going to match up with this piece here. So let's go ahead and put that on top of that. 
just like that there. And then we're going to screw that in with an RM screw. Here we got our screw loaded up. We're going to put it right in that hole right there. And we're going to screw that down in there. Okay, and it's going to look just like that. It should be able to rotate a few degrees back and forth, but I think once the leg is on there, it should work better. But boy, that thing is really tight. You know what I might actually do? Let's put a little bit of oil on that. I'm going to put a little bit of oil on that just so that isn't so like hard to rotate because that should have some lubricant in there, right? So just hard metal on metal. Put a little bit of lubricant in there. There we go. There, that's better. If I can make any suggestion to you, add some oil to that because it's just metal on metal. So I'll put a little oil in there. All right, now we got the inner left calf here. Look at this thing, big old piece of metal. It looks pretty nice. And we're gonna be adding that to the foot here. That's yeah, gonna be going this way. You see these two pins here are gonna go in these two holes right here, just like that. And then we're gonna secure that into the top hole there with one FM screw. A little bit of a bigger screw. All right, and I'm gonna put a little bloop oil right in there. There we go. And we're gonna put that right back over the top again, and we're gonna screw that in with that screw right here. There we go. All right, it's going to look just like that. Nice. All right, that's the end of stage 16. Let's go ahead and move on to stage 17. Come quietly or there will be trouble. All right, here we are with stage 17. Designing RoboCop. We got some storyboard stuff here. Here we go on our parts. Looks like we're going to be putting the other like tendon piece on the back of the leg. Yep, just like we uh, did on the right leg, but this one's going to be attaching to the calf, I think. All right, quick look through the rest of the magazine here. Let's go ahead and get started. All right, first we're gonna start with 17C and 17B. That's these two pieces here. And uh, 17B is just going to insert right into it like that. All right, now we're gonna spin it around this direction. And we got 17A, this piece here. And we're gonna put that on the end of 17B like this. And we're gonna screw that in with an AM screw. First, a little bloop of oil, a little bloop. Like that. Got my AM screw here. I'm gonna get a smaller bit. We're gonna put that on the end like we had it and screw that on. Just like that. Okay, now we got uh, 17E, this half circle looking piece, and 17F, the one with the little screw parts on it here. And we're gonna take this piece this way around, and we're gonna put 17E over this ball. It's gonna form a ball joint here, just like that. And then 17F is going to go over the other side and sandwich it together like this. And then we're going to screw that together here and here with the two BP screws. Just going to hold that down like this and I'm going to screw it in from right here. Not super tight, just snug. And then I'm going to do the other side. All right. It'll be like that. Should be able to move it around a little bit. Okay, it's going to look just like this. All right, now we got 17D, this piece here, and we're going to be putting that right into the end of 17C here. Yeah, it shows it going this way, this way around, if you hold it this direction, with the slanted part going this way. And it slides in just like that. All right, that's the end of stage 17. Let's move on to stage 18. You call me. Robocop. Okay, here we are, stage 18. Let's get a look in the magazine. Designing Robocop part five. Look through real quick. Here's our parts here. 
the left knee joint is what we're going to be working on in this stage. Okay, and it's going to be the parts that's going to be going into his left knee here. And this is what it's going to look like when we're done. Move on through the rest of the magazine here. All right, let's get started. All right, we got 18B here. We got the little nut here that's 18G, and this piece is 18F and two SP screws. Yeah, we're going to be putting the nut, dropping the nut right down into this uh, hole right here that's shaped just like it. We're just going to drop it down in there, just like that. And then this piece is going to go over the top of it, this way around uh, with the these two holes over those two holes, and we're going to screw that in with those two screws. So we can get a screw on our screwdriver here, and I have this on low speed here, so I don't want to, I don't want to crank these screws. These are small screws. I think I'm going to go ahead and put this on top of it, on the screw like that, and then hold it with my finger, and then put that on the hole to get it started. Just a little tricky. That little piece wants to keep sliding around. All right. Now we can move it into place and get to that other one. Get this one in. All right, it's gonna look just like that. Okay, now we got 18A, 18D, and 18C, and we're gonna drop the spring right over this large pin in the center here of 18A. Just drop it right over it. And then we're gonna put this piece on with this tab slotting into this slot right here and the um the grooves facing outwards and we're just going to slide it down on there like that kind of a tight fit and it's going to look like that okay now we got 18e this metal piece here and it's going to be sitting right over the top of that this way around with these grooves going over those grooves like this then we got 18B, this piece that we were working on. These two pins here are going to set over these holes that's down in the bottom, down in there. Just like this. Okay? And then we're going to screw that in through these two holes, here and here, with two BP screws. All right, it's going to look just like that. All right, now we got 18H, this long screw here. And that's going to go this way. It's going to go through this hole and screw into that nut that we put in on this side. So let's go ahead and get that put in there. Tighten that down. This is a reinforcement bolt. And get that nice and snug down. And it should be able to rotate. Oh my gosh. Very stiff, but it does rotate. I don't know that it rotates freely like it says, uh, but it does rotate. There we go. And we'll put that to the side for a later stage. All right, guys, that is the end of box five. And this is our pieces right here that we have from this box. So let's go ahead and get back to the main camera. Come quietly or there will be trouble. All right, guys, again, we are all done with box five now, stages 15 through 18. And now we have the uh, left foot and part of the lower leg here. Looking pretty cool. Uh, we have this uh, section of the knee joint that we just built. And this is the, um, like the tendon on the back of his leg piece here. And that'll all be connecting in a later box that we get so yeah so far having a lot of fun building this one everything looks really good on it like i always say i can't wait to see this one done all the way but anyways guys if you like these kind of modeling videos make sure you give the video a thumbs up and a subscribe it helps the channel out immensely and i'll see you next time i'm chewy solo and this is black and red builds see now that is a whole lot of fun right there.